All right, guys, we're here today at the Scar Audio headquarters. We're going to be doing an amp dyno test on the Scar Audio SKV2 1500.1D monoblock amplifier. This is competition grade amp, one aught inputs, stable at one ohm daily, just a really badass overall amplifier. Uh, so, without further ado, we're going to be jumping into the amp dyno test on our SMD81 and show you what this thing can do on certified, uncertified, and dynamic burst power runs. All right, so like I said, we're going to go ahead and start with the certified dyno run on the SKV2 1500. And we're going to do that at a 1 ohm impedance load. Scroll over here to 1 ohm, select it. Now we're going to go ahead and begin our test. So you can go ahead and watch your screen there. Again, this is a certified run at 1 ohm. So as you can see on your display, 1,556 watts at that 1 ohm load, 13.92 volts. Obviously, uh, conservatively rated at 14.4 SKV2 1500, you can see it's doing more than rated power at a lesser than 14.4 voltage load. So, very successful dyno test. We're going to go ahead and move on to the uncertified test next. Stay tuned. All right, guys, now we're moving on to our uncertified test on the SKV2 1500. So, we're going to go ahead and select that here on our amp dyno. We're going to do that at a 1 ohm load again. We're ready to begin our dyno. Go ahead and click start. Now I'm going to run the track, which is a 40 hertz sign signal. So as you can see, the test is running. So following a very successful certified test over rated power, now the uncertified test is showing the same results. 1,697 watts at a 1 ohm load at 13.77 volts. So again, under the 14.4 rated uh, and putting out quite a bit more than RMS power. Now we're going to go ahead and move on to our dynamic and final amp dyno test. All right, and last but not least, we're going to go ahead and jump into our final dynamic power run on the SKV2 1500 at a 1 ohm load. And what this test does is it measures peak power or burst power output of the amplifier. And a lot of you guys tend to, tend to like this one uh, more so than the others because, you know, this is that max power rating that you're looking for. So go ahead and start the dyno. We're going to start the track. And here you go, go ahead and watch your screen and it's going to send a, a burst signal, which is what it's showing now. Running, and it looks like the test is just about to finish. So, test is finished and we have 2,140 watts at that 1 ohm load. At just slightly less than rated voltage, uh, we got 14.23 in our test and, and like I said before, 14.4 is where they're rated. So quite a bit more power output than, than what we rate them at conservatively and uh, overall just a great class D monoblock amplifier. Thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned for more.